Hello my friends and my family, thank you guys for clicking playing, I hope everybody's doing well and welcome to my channel. For this video, I want to show you guys a part of Ixtapa that not a lot of people get to see. And that's because it's rainy season. Not a lot of people vacation here during those times. But on this occasion, I want to share with you guys that it's still beautiful, it's still amazing, even when it's raining. For those of you guys that are not familiar with Ixtapa, this is the Ixtapa Highway and we are coming from Cihuataneco and we're gonna follow this highway all the way down into the heart of Ixtapa we're gonna pass on the left Contramar Las Brisas, Casa Bonita on the right all the way down passing the Ixtapa letters into the Ixtapa Square which a lot of you guys are already familiar with we're gonna make our way into the Ixtapa Palace going over towards Playa Linda or the Ixtapa Island but Instead, we're gonna take a right going to La Puerta, and that's where we'll end this video. La Puerta is a very authentic Mexican town right behind Tactuay, Ixtapa. It's between Cihuatanejo and Ixtapa. This highway actually divides from Cihuatanejo into two ways, one going to Ixtapa and one to La Puerta. So if you've never been here during the rainy season, please just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Base. I guess anybody who comes to Mexico at all is familiar with the tope. So is your car, I bet. Here's Casa Bonita Hotel. And here to the left is Contramar Las Brisas. Keep that in mind for my following video. Tennis court over there. And the golf course residence. And here we're going to be coming up to one of the two golf courses here in Ixtapa. This is the newly redone golf course. It's only been a couple months since they redid it. Two amazing golf courses here, one by the marina and one here, which used to be an old coconut plantation, converted to a golf course. Now we're passing the tourist market, all closed down because it's raining. Beautiful rainy evening at Stapa. And we are entering Stapa Central, this week, Stapa sign. That's how you know you've made it. And right in there is the Ixtapa Square, as we fondly call it, where you'll find restaurants and bars and shops. Pretty much every kind of little place you could find if you want to shop at ice cream parlors. Tattoo parlors, even. High-end clothing boutiques. Silver jewelry. There's Nacho's jewelry store. And Ruby's jewelry there. They even have name brands like Massimo here. And there's Senior Frogs. Everybody knows Senior Frogs. Go there to party your ass off. 
and a pharmacy on just about every corner here in Mexico. Chili beans, one of our favorite restaurants. Gotta love chili beans. And the famous Ata Sushi Bar, Santander Bank, where you get the best banking rates and all of it stuff right here on the boulevard. And of course, Ohana's, you cannot miss Ohana's on a Saturday night, they're pumping the music. All you have to do is listen for the music, walk in that direction, and you'll end up in Ohana's. Soros, our favorite little bar. We can stop at when we just want to get in and out. Emilio's Italiano Pastas and Pizza. Of course, everybody knows the Oxo in Mexico. The local corner stores. The beloved, the love, the beloved, our beloved Ricardo's Restaurant Day. We love Ricardo. He's one of our great friends and. Highlight of Ixtapa, Ixtapa Palace, and the Costa de Tebron, our favorite seafood restaurant. The best gym in Ixtapa, right here at Ixtapa Palace. Yeah, pizzeria and bakery. Oh, don't forget about the cakes and the baked goods there, Alejandro. <laughs> Ixtapa Palace is an amazing resort, soon to be turned into a world-class health and wellness resort. With in addition for seniors, it will blow your mind. And you are passing through Ixtapa on the main boulevard, about to enter the junction where you can go left and a spirit to fly a linda right point where if you need to know where you're going, hey, go to the Oxo. Everybody knows where the Oxo is. And this is the point where we can either keep going to go to Ixtapa Island or Playa Linda or take a right to go to the back of Ixtapa into La Puerta or we can take a left into San Jose. There is a bicycle path connecting both Ixtapa and La Puerta, but only bicycles or motorcycles can fit through there. Morocco is one of the residential communities here next to La Puerta. A lot of Americans and Canadians like to live there. Over there is La Puerta in Morocoy, another entrance to Morocoy. We are here, we're going to turn left to go to San Jose and Barbulia. Did I say that right, Yolanda? Barbulia. For those of you guys that are subscribed, thank you for subscribing. And for those of you guys that are not subscribed yet, on the following video, we're going to be rediscovering, stepping back in time into a lost world here in Ixtapa, Siwataneco. You don't have to subscribe, but you won't want to miss it. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.